To make sure I went down as an all-time school legend, I deliberately scored a spectacular own goal in our end of Term Cup final. <laughs> David's team. Okay. You, you just okay. wanted to make a name for yourself? Yeah, I wanted to, you know, um, be memorable, you know? Okay. No one really remembers the kind of average guy, but they remember that kind of, you know, the wacky guy scored an own goal. The idiot. And yeah, yeah the idiot. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. What, what was the reaction to, to you? What was that? What was well, you first, it's like, you know, my team were like, like, what are you doing? Like, this is ridiculous. But, you know, afterwards, they were like, that was legendary, mate, you know? <laughs> how, how, how long after? after? Sort of like five ten, years yeah, after? Yeah, five, ten years later. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, though, the reason why it was so spectacular is it wasn't just a normal own goal. I didn't just, you know, it was a kind of a scissor kick. <laughs> so, yeah, it, yeah. Now, you're looking at me and going, this isn't the physique of a, a football player. <laughs> That's absolutely but right. If you've, seen me on, uh, <laughs> if you've seen me on, like, Soccer AM or some yeah. other shows, you'll see that I've got techers, mate. Do you know what they say? You, you know, you either, was it, die a hero or live long enough to become a villain? So <laughs> I was who, like... Who says that? <laughs> is that... I think I've got the quote wrong. Is that the quote? No, not quite. You know what I mean. Let me ask you a question. What were you known for at school before that incident? I was... Misquoting people. <laughs> <laughs> I was complete, like, school clown. Um, I used to... I actually got an award for bunking in school. I was never there. They gave me the early bird award. <laughs> I used to, like... I used to turn up in the morning, sign in, and then go out. I did stuff like that. I was The zany. teachers gave you a prize? Yeah. At the end of, like, year 11. Had they fully understood their role? <laughs> <laughs> Looking back, I don't think they did. Because I was really proud of that award. So, well, it's, um, in a sense, the school is at fault if this is true, because you've... <laughs> essentially, they've established an educational environment where doing what is ostensibly the opposite of the aim of any... <laughs> <laughs> is to be rewarded. Yeah. So you said, no, I'm not going to do the obvious thing and score in the opponent's goal. I'm... And how many serial killers went to your school? <laughs> <laughs> I quite enjoyed the vision there, the vision there of parents' night. The first parents' night for you two, I think it's... that school mm. is going to be trembling. Yeah. <laughs> well, you say that, if you look, look at that line-up there, doesn't it look as if they're just dropping their Greg off at university? <laughs> He's not, he's not your biological son. <laughs> you are David's far more beautiful, younger second wife. <laughs> and you don't get on with Greg, that's coming across. <laughs> so what are you going to say? Oh, Greg, you I must th know more about football than we do. I think it's true. I think he's, you think it's I true? Think he's a, a big enough clown what to have you, done that. What do you think? <laughs> I think if Greg thinks it's true, I let's, think say, it's let's true. say true. I think it's true. Uh, okay. She's good, trying to good. bond let's... with her stepson. Asim, <laughs> <laughs> was it true or were you telling a lie? It was a lie. Oh. Oh. 